a well. Whenever you see a toad running in a broad daylight, if something is not pursuing it, it is pursuing something. <laughs> oh no, you are welcome. When I saw you, I knew you were here to discuss something with me. Uh, <clears throat> problems are not meant to destroy us. But it is to strengthen us and give us the willpower to accomplish our God-given destiny. This life is unpredictable. It is millennials. And it won't be here forever. When a day breaks, it is gone. And gone forever. And so is our time. Time is so precious to us in everything we do. Wait, oh no. Talk to me in the language I will understand. It is the heir apparent to the throne. Igwe, somebody that will succeed you when you are gone. The happiness of this throne will not be complete without somebody, without a male child that will succeed you. Akedi, my brother, I appreciate all your effort in this. It shows that you care. But I want to tell you, there is something we fail to understand. That happiness does not come from what we want, but from appreciating that which we have. You know, I cannot challenge the gods. It has never been the will of God that you will not have a major idea with. It is. If not, what's stopping me from having a male child? I am your brother. I can never deceive you. It would be a very shameful thing that this throne goes to another family when you are gone. History will never forgive me for not crying out loud. It will think about it. Think about it. with your brother. What about the meeting? You know what I'm talking about, Your Majesty. It's about the heir apparent to the throne. I do not care. The gods. They know about our predicament. I know you're not bothered. But I am Your Majesty. What if a stranger comes and takes over the throne? Your Majesty, what will be my fate? Then let the will of the gods prevail. Wipe your tears. What will be, will be. I know, but it's in situations like this, you... Do not talk again. Always learn to appreciate your present condition, for you do not know why God made it so. But do not spoil the happiness. 
happiness and joy of this kingdom with tears and sorrow. Come. <laughs> now, smile for me. Eh? You know I love you. Yes. <laughs> That's my wife. <sighs> again. I've told you to stop crying. If you continue like this, you will hurt yourself. Look, look. Pull yourself together. Please. If there is anybody that should be worried in this issue, it should be me. But you're not. You seem not to be worried about this whole thing. I am, my dear. I am. But what can I do? A lot. You can do a lot of things. You know what to do for you to have a male child. I will take over the throne. Like what and what? Your Majesty, you and I know what to do. To have a male child, to have a son. Please stop pulling my legs. Look, let me tell you this. I don't know exactly what you are talking about. But one thing I am very, very sure is that I'm not going to adopt any child. Then marry a second wife. That will solve all this drama. Please, Your Majesty. Oh, my little love. Oh, my little one of whole Laga Kingdom. <laughs> you are welcome to my house. Oh, no. I kid you, more Kala, one of whole Laga Kingdom. I greet you. <laughs> Hey, what do I owe this royal visit? Oh no. I came to discuss something very important with you. You are the know of this kingdom. Oh. And as a matter of fact, the king's brother. Mm. It's about the meeting you had with the king at the palace. Mm. Concerning the heir apparent to the throne. Mm. Oh no. It's never the will of God that I will stay without a male child. Mm -hmm. Though I know that age is not by my side. Mm. So I came to plead with you. Mm. As the king's brother, that we join hands together as a king's brother for us to beg my husband, the king, to take another wife. He loves you so much, and that's exactly his problem. But that shouldn't be a problem, no. I'll get my husband a good woman. A loving woman. Mm. What you said is true. In this our kingdom, we have beautiful, intelligent, and hardworking young girls everywhere that are suitable for marriage. 
that can make good housewives. Oh, no, I'm not talking about the young girls in this kingdom. I have someone in mind already. <laughs> la 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 la. <laughs> Do I know her? Yes. Very well. She's Obioma the widow. Is there any problem with that? <laughs> no. That's no problem at all. Uh, Obioma is not suitable for the king. Oh no, did you notice anything strange in her character? Yes. Number one, she is a widow. We don't even know what killed her husband. It could be S. And number two, if the king wants to marry another wife, for the reason we all know, it shouldn't be an old woman that will not be capable of giving birth to, to, to children. He should go for a, a, a young girl that can produce and reproduce. No, I can assure you that Obioma is capable of handling all those things that you just said. Trust me on that. Uh, is there something else about her? I am your blood brother and I can never be alive and allow you make mistake that people will be asking questions I am deeply concerned about the condition of this palace that we don't have somebody that will replace you after you are gone. I am deeply concerned. Obioma is a good woman. There is no doubt about it. I am not quarreling with that. But the only problem I have is that Obioma is not suitable for the reason we are looking for a woman that will bear you a son. Is she not up to 50 or even more than 50? She has seen her many Porsche. Oh yes, so there is no way she can conceive. So the reason we are looking for her might eventually turn out to be Pennywise palm foolish. Igwe, please. The Obioma we are talking about, go to her, go and ask questions. She doesn't have a, a, a son for the late husband. It's only two girls. So what's the point bringing her in? Igwe, please, don't, don't be used. Don't be used. Akede, my brother, mm -hmm. I understand what you have just said. I, I, I have even told uh, Oloma the same thing. But you know women, once their minds are made up, they will never go back. Her mind is made up on this particular woman. At times I begin to wonder <laughs> if it is not the same Nati Rebel that we used to know in those days in CKC. <laughs> you are a guy man. So find a way to convince her. You are a guy man. Find a way to convince her so that we will not make the mistake that we will regret afterwards. Igwe, please. Akiri Amoka. Hey! Osa can say call God down. Oh, let him matter up. Oh, 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 All is not well. My house is on fire. Jesus. What happened? Eh? 
What's wrong with you? Or the king? Eh? Tell me, tell me my friend, tell me. I'm here for just tell me. Obiama. Yes, my queen. Something God gave to me on a platter of gold is about to slip off my fingers. My queen, what is it? Tell me. I'm here for you. Obiama. Okay. Okay. Just say it. Don't go back. Just say it. I promise. Don't I... go back. I want you. Go ahead. Obiama, I want you to marry my husband. So you can save me from this shame. Okay, would you rather prefer to hear that this royalty was taken away from me because I couldn't give birth to a male child? Please, I beg you. Please. Please save me. Why are you crying? Obioma, talk to me. Why are you crying? Makede, I am fine. Why are you here? Why did you come here? You are sitting here crying and you are telling me you are fine. I am fine. I said, I am fine. Tell me why you came to my house. Okay, if you said so. I saw the queen drove out of this compound. Tell me, what has she come to tell you? She came to visit me as usual. Is that your business? Basangi? She came to visit you as usual. Anyway, the reason I am here is to warn you. That I will never trade your love with another man in this kingdom. So, if she has come here to tell you to marry the king, tell her no. Is there anything bothering you? Amaka, no. Mama, what are you hiding from us? Tell us, is there any problem? I am not hiding anything from you people. Just that I'm not hungry. I don't feel like eating anything. Mama. Mama, you've been in this mood since we came back. And you've refused to eat. What is going on? What is it? Uchechuku, nothing is going on. Just that when I went to the palace this morning, Queen Mother gave me little food. And I still have it in my stomach. I'm not hungry. If we should go ahead and eat. Mama, when you went to the palace this evening, Queen Mother gave you food and it's still in your stomach. You are not hungry. Okwaya? It's okay. I'm not hungry too. Mama. Mama, why are you doing this? We've not eaten since morning. Why are you punishing us? Why? Amaka, would you like to Let's eat. Oh, let's eat. Are you ready to eat now? Yes, yes. Okay. 
I've lost my guitar. Yes. And you will eat. Princess Adeze, I prefer an adoption for my father instead of him marrying a second wife. Even though that, Obioma is too old for him. That's if he would marry. Sweetheart, adoption is out of it because of our culture. And Adeze, what makes you think that Obioma will not be able to conceive? Well, you know what, Mom? We should look for a young, beautiful girl for him that would conceive for him and not a woman. Just an ordinary woman for comparison. Just for a companion, okay, mother? Oh, Adeze. Talk like a Christian daughter that you are. At what age did Sarah conceive and gave birth to a son? You're talking about Sarah, Mama. Of course I know Sarah conceived at the age of 90 years. Oh. And perhaps that's the divine miracle. And that same divine miracle, my dear, will happen in this royal house. In Jesus' name. Amen. amen. No, mother. I refuse to say amen to this. What's all this? You're taking the wrong step. And I'm out of it. Um, perhaps, mom. What did my father say about it? Your father have no choice. My father has no choice? Yes. No, mother, I totally disagree with you on this. My father has a choice. But what's all this, mother? Why do you like this woman to this extent? Why? I dare say, this woman is a woman I trust. Overconfidence is worrying me right now. I have confidence in her. Hmm. Anyways, just don't say I did not advise you. Oh, thank you, the chief magistrate of this royal family. I've heard your advice, and to you, my beautiful daughter, thank you. You're welcome, madam. You better you smile. Of course, I'm doing that. <laughs> thank you. Mm -hmm. The thought of what you requested from me has completely disorganized me. I have not been myself until now. I'm sorry. But that is the same reason why I'm here. My queen. Yes. I thought you understood me. Obioma, do you think that if you were in my shoes that I will abandon you? That I will reject you? Obioma, do you think I will allow you to waste your tears over something I can do for you. Over something I can solve for you. Do you think I will reject you at that point? Obioma. We have so many beautiful young girls in this kingdom. We also have beautiful widows. But I rejected them all. I chose you. Not because you're the most beautiful. 
But because you are my friend, I need my friend. I need someone that can take care of my family the way I have handled it all these years. Yama, you promised. You promised never to leave me. If I should know. Please, please don't do it. Chineke. Uche. What did she do to her mother that makes her want to kneel down for her? Mama can't want me. He had the Kuyugo. Please don't do it. Let me go and find out. Yeah, okay. Sit down here. It's like you don't have respect, Abi. Let me go and find out what is happening there. How is it your business? No, tell me. How does it concern you? Help me. You will bring a heavy cost on me if you kneel before me. Please help me. Thank you. Please don't do it. Help me. Easy. Huh? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, my dear. Royal tea is very good. Mm. It's too sweet. My sister, I thank God for this new life. Oh. Mm. Mm. I'm telling you, I'm not mm. I'm not a princess. So, mm. 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 My dear, this life, eh? this life is something you cannot predict. It's something you can't just produce this life at all. I'm telling you. Mm. No. It can change between the two of my eyes. <laughs> it can change from bad to good or from good to bad. Mm -hmm. But in our case, it's from bad to good, my sister. And then. Mm. 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 Oh. This kind of life, eh? Mm. Mm. Yes, my princess. Appreciation for everything you have. Oh, Come on. What are you doing here? I've gone to bed. Are you kidding me? No, I'm feeling very sleepy. You think this is the best place for you to sleep? No, I thought... Stop, Patty. Get up and go to your husband's room. Go to your husband's room.
Who asked did you bring this? Uh, my queen. It's Missy Joma. I called you all here to make something clear to you. These two girls are not maids in this palace. They are like daughters to me. I would like you all to serve them. Go on a run for them. Clean their rooms, dress their beds, and serve them whatever food the desire and I want you all to respect them in this palace have I made myself clear to you all yes, yes mother. Mother. you all can go thank you my queen it's okay my dear thank you my queen you're welcome my fellow woman and friend I had a conversation with the children today. Conversation? And what about it? Mm? About their future, of course. And what did they tell you? They both chose overseas. <laughs> These children will not kill me. Do you know, even before their father died, they both had this dream of traveling overseas to further their studies. But you know, we couldn't achieve that. That wish is granted. My queen, how do you mean? I love children with visions. I'll send them overseas. My queen, you're joking, right? I mean every word I just said. Cheers. Ah! Cheers. Thank you. Father will give you praise. Thank you, Lord for this opportunity, for bringing us thus far. We never knew we would be here today. But we appreciate you. My children are going overseas. How would I have expected that it will come to pass? It is all you're doing. We appreciate you in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are going overseas will not be in vain. Amen. You will study. Amen. You will be imparted. Amen. And you will come home better people to impart a society in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's celebrate. Because God has done us well. In the name of the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. Let me pour you some drinks. <laughs>'Cause death is a blessing to us. Why do you say that? What do you mean by that? Uchi, are you seriously asking me that question? Just take a look at us. 
Our conditions have changed within a twinkle of the eyes. Our mother is now the queen, the king's wife. And in our own case, the queen has promised to send us overseas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mama, mama, is the blessing not too much, mama? You know, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm so happy. I feel like our dreams have finally come true. You want me to answer that? Yes. My father's death wasn't a blessing to us. Rather, it brought us blessings. Yes, Mama. You're right. <laughs> You're very correct. <laughs> May his soul rest in peace. Amen. Amen. What did you eat? I, I ate what every other person ate. And for how long have you been uh, vomiting? Huh? Just now. Just now, you are. Then we have to go to the hospital. Something is wrong between the two of them. I just want them to be okay. They're fine. I want them to be fine. Did it go?
you are both pregnant for me. Ah! <laughs> of our I salute you. Even when men are them. Come, 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 come. Oh. This is good. Yeah? Okay. Your Highness. Fetch my brother Akidi right now. Okay. This calls for celebration. Okay. Ah. ah, sweet. That is good. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Let's, let's, let's wait for Akidi. Ah. Mother, but what should you give it to a male and she give it to a female? What will father do? Oh, you see, Adesi, that's the problem I have with you. You ask the wrong question to the wrong person. When you get to your father's side, could you please ask him this question? He will give you a better answer. My darling. My God is wonderful. Lord. How can you at this age conceive? You see? That is why my God is great. He has proven science wrong. So believe me, God is faithful. Hmm. Finally now, I'm happy. God has answered my prayer. I just pray God gives me two brothers from your womb, mother. I can see a lawyer changing his, uh, her statement. Uh, he's okay. You're, you're becoming reasonable. You talk like a good girl. Oh, you're probably fail. Ada, Ada. us once more. Father, we say thank you. We commit this into your able hands, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. There is something that makes me come into your presence, my helper. My helper, oh, my helper. There is something that makes me come into your presence, my helper. You should have told us you're not happy that they are traveling. We can, yes. we can still change our mind. The queen is not like that. It's just that I will miss them. I know. Yes, Obi your mind. You should allow them go so that they will not miss their flight. Huh? Eh? Well, I'll take care. God will protect you. Amen. God bless you both. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go to the car now. I know. I know. I know. I know. I Appreciation, 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 
And that queen mother is sending them abroad. Hey, I wish to be them. Seriously. Stop wishing. Because it can never be them. We are just maidens. Better go back to your duty post. Excuse me. I better go, Joe. All the same. I wish to be like I'm them. telling you. What is it? Queen Mother, Queen Obiama is in labor. She's what? what? Labor. Let me go to the hospital. Wait, let's go together. Your Majesty, it is not the necessary. Let me go. I have already made up my mind. We shall go together. Stay this outside to pick us up. Let's go. Let's go. Push! 
Talk to me. Doctor, speak to me. Congratulations. Your two wives deliver two fancy baby boys. Oh my god. Oh, you are a tap shooter. Doctor, please. Among the two wives, who was the first to deliver? Your first wife delivered at exactly 11.45. Then the second one, 11.59. Just 14 seconds later. No lager. Oh no. In an Asian now. Oh no. No lager. The gods of our life. They are wise. My king, how about our son's forthcoming birthday celebration? How do we go about it? What are the plans? Don't you worry. It's going to be a surprise. Even to me? Yes. <laughs> My king and your wife, just let me into the secret. Then it won't be a surprise anymore. <laughs> You're here. How are you? I'm fine, mother. I'm just coming from your room. Why? I actually went to see you so I can let you know that I and my brother are going out. Oh, okay. No problem. Just be safe. And take care of your brother. It's alright, mother. Igwe. Alright. So make me to take my Okay. See you later. Alright, mother. Let me into the secret, please. Then it won't be a surprise again. Bro, the design is ready. Take a look. That estate we just bought, huh? Forget about the state, the condition that it's in right now. I know it's in a mess, okay? But by the time I am done, huh? By the time we're done, this is what it's going to look like. Believe me, it's going to be the most beautiful estate in Nigeria. Trust me, state of the art. Check it out. This is nice. I told you. Uh -huh. And the, the kind of money we are going to make, believe me, 
if we sell these houses, we'll make three times the amount we spent buying them. And but for that, the by the fence and that yeah. water and log side, then, yeah. then there is need for retaining water. Of course, of course. It will be handled that. Right? Don't, don't worry about that. Okay. Everything will be taken care of. You like it, eh? Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, but uh, listen, eh? Okay. I have, I have been with that girl, that same girl. You know what? Just wait. Look at what she just wrote me now. She said, uh, yeah. I thought you guys are twins. Uh, though you don't look alike, but. Uh, but you do things in common. Wear the same kind of clothes, same kind of shoes, wristwatches, and all that. <laughs> you say, I the envy you now. This <laughs> guy, uh, honestly. Oh, I can. Alright, uh, you can ask her where she is at the moment. Okay. And then tell her to send you her picture so you can see what she looks like. Okay. Look at her picture. Wow. Beautiful, she's beautiful. <laughs> she said that she is in Calabar right now. Okay. It's cool. But she's from Ulaga Kingdom. Alright. Our kingdom. Really? <laughs> yeah. Nice. What a coincidence. So what what do I tell her now? Boy, this get fine. Oh. It can uh, <laughs> always distract it. Alright, if you want to continue chatting with her, uh I don't know, ask her something else. Ask her her level in school and probably her course as well. Hmm? She says she is in 200 level okay. in estate management. She's reading estate management. Wow. Estate management? Yes. Really? Wow. That's nice. That way we can employ her in one of our companies. She can even be part of this project. How can you employ somebody who is in a 200 level? Well, just tell me say you like the girl. <laughs> but I think bad you have style. <laughs> hey! Okay. Okay, I'll be honest. I think she's beautiful and I think I like her too. But you're my brother. If you want to have her, it's okay. You have my support. Really? Hey! Man, you're my nigga for life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this chick, I will go down well with her. Honestly. Time I'm done with this estate. Oh my god. It's going to be the most beautiful estate in the world. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Hmm? Believe me, I can't wait to start working on this estate. Oh. Oh. Oh, the estate. Believe me, it's going to be the, the finest estate in the world and we'll make so much money from it. Of my two sons. Mm -hmm. 
Um, it happens to be their thirty-fifth birthday, oh. <laughs> and they are going to cut the cake so that we all will eat. <laughs> um, they are going to cut the cake at the count of three. Now, one, two. In addition to this cake we have here, I am going to the Royal House of Olaga will present these two khakis to them. <laughs> um, so, I will hand it over to them. What could be keeping Ogechi? Bro! Bro, what's up, man? Hurry up! Ah. I'm set. <laughs> yes, but I'll drive. You drive? I'll drive. I'll drive. I'll drive. I'll drive. I'll drive. you give to me for giving you a good food. I'll marry your grandfather. You will marry my own grandfather. Hey! Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh-huh. How are you? I'm alright. Okay. What do you sell? Yes, I have plantain, have fish. I even have pomo and beans. Uh, I've just put some plantain and fish. You don't want it mixed? Uh, just plantain and fish. Very good. He dashed in extra solid. Jay, give me 200 now. 
Ah, uh -uh. go. Just two hundred naira. Your head. I will not only give you two hundred naira. I will give you my whole shop. That's it. Yeah. Man, you are greedy. I'm not that shameful. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not What's the problem? What is bothering you? There's no problem actually, I just... Just think. That girl, that girl we saw... I've just been wondering, how can she be doing a business like that? I mean, selling roasted plantain on the road. So that is what you are wondering about. If she's not doing it, who has it? Or would you have done it? That's not my point. My point is this, she's... She's very beautiful. And she looks smart, she looks intelligent. I mean, a young girl like that should be in school. Should be in school, education is key. You know? And probably after that she'll go for her to become somebody great in future. Not selling planting. Okay, I don't understand you. Why are you sounding like this? Or do you know her before? Uh, I don't know. I don't know her, but I think I like her. <laughs> <laughs> now you just unveil the truth. Because I was wondering how suddenly you felt hungry again. <laughs> but Ogechi, yeah. you are not in the same cadre with that girl. You are not of the same class at all. You are a prince and she is a commoner. You shouldn't be seen mingling with people like that. She is a low life. Welcome to my house. Please sit down. Thank you very much. Oh no, you sent for me. Yes. I called you because there is something very urgent and very important I want us to discuss before it becomes late. And what could that be? I called you the heir apparent. For Laga Kingdom. But in the eyes of your father and the entire people of Olaga, you are not. <sighs> no. What sort of joke is that? No, 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 no. It is not a joke. It is a very serious matter. Yes. You were born before Gage. But because Uloma is the first wife, the bed rights were exchanged and the privilege given to Uloma as the first wife. I am your uncle. I can never deceive you because I like you. Now, have you ever asked yourself this? Between you and the Oh, Geji, who is the eldest? Well, uh, you know, I, I haven't. 
but I'm quite sure I'm older than Ogechi. Because in terms of choosing things, I always choose before him. Look, Otama. I will chuck you the more. Do you remember what happened on your birthday? I, I can't remember anything. Your father presented two calves. But gave Ogechi one of the keys before you. No, you're right there. It happened like that. And because of this, Ogechi chose before you. Yes, I called you because there is something very urgent and very important I want us to discuss before it becomes late. I called you the heir apparent of Olaga Kingdom. But in the eyes of your father and the entire people of Olaga, you are not. You were born before Ogechi. But because Uloma is the first wife, the birth rights were exchanged and the privilege given to Uloma as the first wife. Your father presented two calves, but gave Ogechi one of the keys before you. And because of this, Ogechi chose before you. I give I ain't got it. Unu, Unu, Gene, Jenna, Bata, Bata, Sir. Oba, my bun, Manju, my Jun, Sir. Ivo, my Kaiga, Nizirona. Oboga, Joey, and my bondi, Mbonandi, a gede, Sibabia, Cavasolani, Dodia. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Yes, I can. Between I and Ogechi, who is the eldest? Why do you ask? Uh, is there anything wrong for me to know between I and my brother who is older? No, there is nothing wrong about you knowing who is older. But honestly, I don't know. Uh, there's nothing wrong about me knowing, but it pointed out you don't know. Mother! Mother, do you know the implication of this? Do you know that one day, just one day, one of us will succeed our father. Mm -hmm, I know. But 
I don't know. You can ask your father. He knows. Hmm. Where can I? What are you driving at? I put it to you that you are a careless mother. Yes. Yes! Sir, this hospital has been sold to another person 15 years ago after the death of the owner. I'm sorry. Good day, my son. Father, there is something I want to ask you. And what would that be, my son? Father, I want to know who is the eldest between Ogechi and I. From where comes that question? That is not the answer to my question. Yes. But I want to know why you ask that question. Don't I have the right to know? You have the right to know. But I want to know what prompted that question. In other words, you will not tell me until I tell you what prompted the question. Yes, my son. Because the toad does not drown in the afternoon for nothing. No problem. shop. Now how do you expect me to live in this condition and go to the shop? But Your I, temperature is very high. But I said I am fine. I am fine. Mama, do not worry. Tomorrow is another day. Oh, just be fine for me. Your customers, they will be looking for you. Oh. Whoever that doesn't see me today should come tomorrow. The most paramount thing for me right now is to see you get better. Please. You might just get well for me. Oh. 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 Find her. I don't know, maybe I'll. Uh, 
But why are you looking this way? Is there any problem? I've been waiting for you. Waiting for me? We need to meet with Father right away. How is he looking this way? She walked to me uh, and asked me. Amongst uh, two of them, Imando Gechi, who is the senior? And what did you tell him? Well, I told him never to ask such a question again. Obioma, your son is growing wings. A very big one at that. Queen Mother, please, I am sorry. But what could have made him ask such a question? Are you asking or you should be telling us what made him ask that question? Queen Mother, please, I am sorry. Hey. Not to worry, two of you. Um, I have told him not never to ask such a question again. And I know he will not repeat. My king, please, I'm, I will talk to him. Better do this. Do that. Tell you the truth. Tell them to show you your birth certificate. Oh no. I'm very grateful. I will always be indebted to you. Meanwhile, let me get you something. Buy yourself some snuff. My prince, my prince, the heir apparent of Olaga Kingdom. <laughs> Hi. Your son is stooping around asking some questions. We all know that Ogechi is the senior. So I want us to handle this with wisdom. Yes, with wisdom. We know Getty and I who is older. Ekene, put down that gun. I will do no such thing. Tell me, put the gun down. Ekene, you point the gun at me. Father, I say put the gun down. Put the gun. Put down the gun. Go. Put down. Who is that? Put down. Who is that? Uh, 
How are you? I'm very fine. Thank you. I hope you recognize me. My prince. <laughs> Why not? Were you not here the other day with your brother when he came to buy plantain? You are very right. You were not here yesterday. What happened? Oh, my mother was sick. So I, I stayed at home to take care of her. Though she's getting better. You came? Of course, I was here but uh, I didn't meet anybody, so I had to leave. Sorry about that. Honestly, my prince, I've been wondering, don't you feel somehow sitting here? Considering your, your status, I'm, I'm fighting it somehow, I'm allowing you to sit here. Now listen to me, if you can sit here, then I can sit here. Because there's no difference between you and I. Please, my prince, don't say that. There's a huge difference between us. You are the prince of Olaga Kingdom. And I am nobody. I refuse to hear that. You are somebody. And you are a special person. Amen, no. <laughs> uh, can you prepare some of this uh, plantain and beans for me? <laughs> Wait, my prince. Don't tell me you're going to sit down here and eat in public. There's nothing wrong with that. I've told you before that there is no difference between you and I. My prince, don't say that. You're the prince of this kingdom and... <laughs> no, please. It's not right. There's nothing wrong with that. I've told you before that there is no difference between you and I. Okay. If you insist, I will. Do you want the right or right? Anyone. So far, you're the one preparing it. I like it. So. He brought me home. My prince, you are welcome. Thank you very much. Please, can we go inside and see him? Don't bother, mother. Mama, my name is Ekene Dilichuku DK1. The heir apparent to the throne of Ulaga. Your daughter told me that you're sick, so I decided to come and see you. Oh, that's nice of you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Mama, please thank him so much. He's a nice man. He ate a plate of food and paid with 5,000 naira. 5,000. I'm telling you, Mama. Oh, my place, thank you. Thank you. Mama is nothing. Okay. Obona! My prince.
Mama, she's a good girl. Mm -hmm. And I like her so much. Uh, use this to buy her some drugs. This is too much. My prince, this is too much. Oh, you can have it. You will still get more. Ah, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much. No problem. God bless you. It's Thank right. you. It's all right. Uh, I will have to run along now. Amara, take good care of Mama. Okay? Gage and the Ekene. Who will succeed our king? Exactly the problem. The moment we sorted it out. Oh, no. Oh, no. What am I hearing? <clears throat> Iwe has traveled to the journey of no return. He has joined his ancestors. Is there any problem? Yes. Can you come down from the car? I need to talk to you. As in, I don't understand you. You mean if I don't step out of this car, you cannot talk? Are you mad? Is something wrong with you? Look at this small boy. Yes, I know when they give birth to. My friend, come down from the car. I need to talk to you. See, don't let me start to. Don't just let me start now. Come down, I need to talk to you. I can open this door. I say you should come down here. I need to talk to you. Are you drunk? How dare you? Do you want to break my window? Try it. If you try it, if you try it, I will shift your job home for you. Get me?
was messed up, so he doesn't deserve any damn respect. What sort of homage are you talking about? Ekene, you're pushing me. Ekene, you're seriously pushing me to the wall. But I promise you, that thing you're looking for, you will get it. That will not happen. Mother, that will not happen because this palace will be hot for you. This palace will be on fire. Let me tell you, nobody will rest in this palace until the best certificate is presented to me. Oh, mother. So you're actually conspiring with those hoodlums in there to send my best friend to Ogechi? That will not happen. Trust me, that will not happen. You know me now. Ha. <sighs> Mother, let me ask you. How much were you paid? Go! <laughs> Elders of our great kingdom. Uh, no. I welcome you all. I will be presiding over this meeting as the heir apparent to the throne of Olaga Kingdom. Point of correction. I am the heir apparent to the throne of Olaga Kingdom. So you preside over no meeting. I am the one to preside over this meeting. Again? It doesn't matter who presides over a meeting. Meeting is meeting. The most important thing is that we we'll make progress and move forward. And I said no. Ekene, don't let me be angry with you. Why are you so disrespectful to everyone here? Ekene, if you don't keep quiet, we'll have no other choice than to punish you. <laughs> there is nothing, none of you, Yes. Honestly, I am starting to lose it. Wokem, I am starting to lose it. Lose it! What is it? Lose it! Let me see if your voltage is high enough to contend with me. Are you talking? Are you talking to death? Eh? Okay. Okay. Oh no, please talk to them. Okay. Sit down. Hmm? Sit down. Oh no! Tell this stupid boy to stop disrespecting me and sit down! You are the stupid boy here! Let me tell you, you are very stupid! Oh no! As far as I'm concerned, this meeting never heard. Again, eh? Hey. Stop! Hey, 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 mother! Stop it! Because you are connived with this hypocrite to send my best friend to this idiot, this nigga. Okechi, you are in a showdown with me. You have me to contend with in this palace. Again, you called us hypocrites. 
como é a que tá é que tá Why are you scattering everywhere? Ekele, I'm talking to you! How does it concern you? I'm asking you! How does it concern you? Why are you talking to me like that? Have you lost your faces? Oh, is that one? You slapped me. And I'll slap you over and over again if you dare open that your trap. You slapped me. No, 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 why are you holding him? Allow him to come and beat me! Is it because I've been quiet in this palace? I'm talking to you. My friend, I'm talking to you. You don't want to stand by there. Stand there. How dare you? How dare you lay your filthy hands on my mother? Huh? How dare you stand before me talking about that? Ass? Listen to me. I'm only keeping quiet because you're my brother. You hear me? The gentle stride of the lion is not a symbol of cowardice. Know this. Let me tell you. When an elephant claims to be the king of the jungle, other animals celebrate its funeral. Kene, today is your lucky day. The next time you will lay your hands on my mother or even go close to her, that day I will skin you alive and bury you in this palace. Why don't you just put up a fight? Put up a fight! Let me wrestle you to the ground. Okay, I am warning you. I am warning you. Be careful with me. My prince, my prince, yeah. I the Amokala. My prince, my prince. I'm going to go. 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 I'm going to I called you because I know you have no hint that Ogech fixed a meeting for the cabinet. What? Wait. You mean Ogech fixed a meeting for the cabinet? Oh, yes, he did. That meeting must not hold! No, it will hold. <laughs> it must hold. Calm down. I will guide you. And give you directions on what to do at that meeting. Before the meeting will start, before anyone comes around, you go and sit on that seat. Yes, you sit on that throne. By so doing, you will be sending the signal that you are the rightful owner of that throne. Oh yes, that, that 
king, that throne belongs to you as the first son. <laughs> oh no. This is why I call you Akidi Amokala. <laughs> you deserve some ransom. <laughs> Whenever you feed me with such information, I will always fill your pocket. <laughs> oh no. It's for you. <laughs> oh no. Thank you very much. What you just told me. Yeah. Let's cheers. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh no. I will have to go. Yes. Oh. Mm. Thank you very much. Yeah. My prince. You recommended old Yoma for my late brother. You know I countered it. I remember. I know Obioma very well. Even before her late husband died. See, your man. This is little compared to what I'll be bringing for you. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Just, I want you, you and your children to be happy. Now I am overwhelmed. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes. I'm more than happy. Please come inside. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to the palace. You can see I'm already dressed for the meeting. Hey, Ibu No, no. Where's scarcity? Huh. I don't know the direction this country is heading to. Don't yeah. mind this, our useless government. Every time, every time, cow, cow and the men are ruling this country. February is the new thing. Amaka, Amaka, out here to go, please. See what he bought for us. Maya Kidi, Maya Kidi, you're welcome. Welcome. See the fish he bought for us. Everything. Hey, hey, fish, fish. Thank you. Maya Kidi, thank you. Thank you. I'm happy that you people are happy. Maya Kidi, thank you. Um, Obi, I will be going, eh? Yes, I will bring more. I will bring more for you. Hey, don't worry. I'm happy. I'm happy. Hey. 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 So what do I offer you as Kola? Just mention anything. Anything at all. Hey, I am fine. Uh, but I have come to say thank you to you for the tubers of yam you gave to me and my children. <laughs> Is that why you are here? Yes, my. Honestly, I appreciate your presence. 
I appreciate you for taking care of me, a widow. God will bless you abundantly. <laughs> mm. You know, Obioma. Yes, I. Whatever I do for you, I see it as I'm doing it for myself. Oh, my thank you. You are a widow. I'm also a widow. The only difference between us is that I don't have children. <laughs> yes, so that reminds me. Now I get it. Why don't you want to remarry? Yes. Wherever your husband is right now, yes. he will be praying for you because he knows you are a good woman. <laughs> now I thank you for the compliment. Yeah. But that does not answer my question. Uh, well, <laughs> concerning that one, I am walking towards that. Hmm. Get back here. Now you are talking. Hmm? That is good. At least you have companion. I have children that will be running all over the place. Eh? <laughs> Thanks for your concern. <laughs> nah, thank you. Oh, yes. let me be on my way. Oh, yeah. hello. You said you don't want to anything. Beautiful woman. <laughs> hmm. yeah. So you're flattering me like this. <laughs> Thank you, all the same. Can't you go I don't bother yourself. You've done enough by providing me seat. Yeah. Yes. Thank you if you say so. <laughs> no. Uh, mm. <coughs> Go ahead and tell it's me. It's not a bad thing. You know. <laughs> hey, my ears are itching. Tell me. Um, it's concerning what we discussed about last time you visited me in my house. The one about getting you another wife. Ah, yes. Hey. God, I thank you. <laughs> Glory to God. And I'm here to tell you that I have found one. <laughs> Glory to God, oh. God, I thank you. I thank you. Glory to God. <laughs> hey, Nine, who is this lucky woman? Who is she? Forget no more. Huh? Uh, it will not surprise you if I tell you that the person is seated right here with me. <laughs> Nine, I don't understand this one. Of your mind. Um, please, I want you to marry me, please, don't turn me down, please, don't say no to me, please. Nay, if I tell you I am not surprised at what you're saying right now, 
that means I am deceiving myself. Because I never expected to hear this kind of word from you. Of all the women presented to me in this village, it is only you that I chose. Please, don't say no to me, please. Oh, please. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? Where on earth have I wronged you, Obiomo? Nayakidi, you have not done anything wrong to me. On the contrary, you have been taking good care of me and my children since my husband died. But I tell you, I will not marry you. I am sorry. I will not marry you. Leave me alone. Never beg you. Go marry someone else. Obiomo. Oh, Guinea. Ah. Look to me straight in the eyes and tell me where I have gone wrong. What have I done? Just give me one reason why you will not marry me. I will give you three reasons. I love my children. I love my late husband. I want to remain in my husband's house. I don't want to remarry. Did you hear what I said? I don't want to remarry. I can leave me alone. But your children are my children. I won't leave them behind. I will accommodate them. Please, marry me, please. Listen, don't you ever come here again to mention that issue. I want one young one, one year old. I want one young one, kitty. Love you, love you, Amma. Give me a look, give me a look. Be on my belly, Amma. Ubioma Baleam Ubioma, you did this to me. But I've been telling you, but you insisted. Naya Kitty, what I'm asking is for a way forward. To stop this boy from causing more problem in the palace. Do you want me to do it, Mama? We know Bioma is the one instigating that boy into causing through all these troubles. Yeah? Otherwise, how could they can they suddenly come up with this idea of birth certificate? Yes. I've been wondering what could make a Kene come up with such an idea. Hmm. Ha! Bioma needs to be cautioned. I know her plans. It's just to destroy the entire royal family. She will appear to you as a saint. But behind her, she is a demon. My baby. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to show you around the world. I will take you to whatever country you want to go. Trust me. <laughs> I believe you so much, my prince. Thank you very much. Thank you too. Let's talk inside the car. I 
love you, my queen. I love you, my queen. When I came back, it's none of your business. I am highly disappointed in you. Oh, Bioma, I never knew that you were a great snake in a great brand. Me? Oh, Bioma. Well, I don't understand. Me, a green snake in a green grass. I am disappointed. It's very disgrace. <sighs> oh, what have I done against you? What did I do to you? We are did I wrong you? I planned well for you. And you plan against me at my back? Come on, please stop saying that. I regret ever having you as a friend. Mama. Come on, back. This is the case. You are sick. You couldn't even give me a call. Come on, I just slight fever. It's not something serious. I was just coming back from Moga. When I saw your daughter coming out of a chemist shop. I said that to buy me this drug. You'll be fine, okay? Mm. Uh. Um. Get me the money in the car. You could have called. Okay, mother, it's not something serious. It's just slight fever. I'll be fine. Go to the hospital with that. Okay, but I told you it's not something serious. I'm already okay. I'm fine, Fever. Stop taking all these drugs you know nothing about. Do as I said. Oh, thank you. God bless you. Oh, God bless you. You will be fine. It's not something serious. Do as I said. Okay?
Emma, let me assure you, you will not. You can't destroy this royal family. I can assure you of that. Queen Mother, don't scream, Mother me. Just get out of my sight because you have nothing to tell me. In fact, you can't say anything to me. Carry your miserable body and get off my sight. Obioma, get out! Gloria! Gloria! You like it? beautiful. <laughs> but Amara, I think he's not a serious person. Gloria, why would you say such a thing? And in my presence too. Why? Amara, if I can't say anything before you, that means that thing is not good. I'm your friend. Do you understand? Understand what? I am right before you. Make me understand. I don't understand. See, the prince of Igala kingdom, I know, is a rich prince. And there's no serious rich prince that will allow his fiancée to do this kind of old business. Do you understand? Amara! Yes. You're making me feel bad right now. You're making me feel... Just think about it. Talk about the angel. He's here. Please. My kiss. My one and only. You're welcome. <laughs> how are you? You're welcome, my friend. Yeah, how are you? Fine. Amara, yeah. I'll see you later. Sure. My prince. Bye bye. Hold on, buddy. Hold on, my woman. Today ends this business. Yes. Why? I'm, I'm going to stay here with you till you finish sales today. You pack your things and say goodbye to this place. Hey, Prince, why should I leave my business? What will I be doing? The future queen of Ulaga Kingdom is not expected to be doing this kind of business. Besides, I, I want to. I want to introduce you to my parents. Thank you so much, my friends. Let me get something. Appreciation. Appreciation. Everything you have. What does he want? I don't know. Maybe he wants to buy plantain. Olga, have you come to buy plantain as usual? Excuse me, can I talk to you? Talk to who? You can't talk to her. You hear me? If you want to buy plantain, buy plantain and leave. As you can see, she's my baby. Come. <laughs> My queen, and we are getting married very soon. Can't you see I've engaged her? Show him, show him. <laughs> so, if you want to buy plantain, buy and leave this place. Uh, Amara, you can stock his car with uh, plantain, fish, give him everything. You know we are actually planning to leave this place. The beans, you can put this 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 pot of beans in his boot. Put all this one on the other seat. Pack everything for him. Just go do it. 
will you be okay with those things? Those items? She... Huh? I'm not doing it on you. Okay, Chi. Stay away from my woman. You feel me? Negodi, I'm a man. Chugu Kasiri, Kahabiri Nudo. Mother, he has done everything. Every bad thing you can think of, he has done, done all. Ah! There's this beautiful girl I like so much. He kind of discouraged me from uh, uh, approaching the girl. Then he went behind my back to go woo the girl. I can't believe that what you've just said is what is bothering you. Mother, you not understand. You not understand that I, I love that girl so much. There is this thing I, 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 I saw. Then get another woman and you will see the same thing in her. Ha! Huh. How are you so bothered? Don't you understand what I'm talking about? I'm not taking this thing from the take it though. Can you do a brother to get the one aside that? This is my palace. <laughs> Take it easy. This is very beautiful. You like the place? Yes. <laughs> this place will soon become your home. <laughs> okay, let's go. I understand you're not used to this too, but very soon you'll be used to it. <laughs>
What are you doing in my room? Mother, I want to introduce the woman I want to marry to you. Suit yourself. But mother, you have to come yes. to visit. Out of my room. Whatever. Get out. Whatever. This is very beautiful. So how are you? I'm fine. What do I offer you? Anything soft. Oh, what did she say? She said I should suit myself. Just ask your girl what she wants because she said she said wanted anything soft. soft. So get it for her. Okay. Where's in there? The girl that sells here, where is she? Oh, she's no more here. The shop now belongs to me. But don't worry, ah, sir. I can serve you now. Um, okay, how, how do I see her? She's in the house. In her house? Okay, can you take me there? Do you know her place? Whatever your brother told me was a lie? How? I don't understand. I fell in love with you first. Huh. That's the truth. I fell in love with you first. Okay, remember that day we, we came back and I bought plantain for you? Yes. I never really wanted to buy anything. Believe me, I was attracted to you. I wanted to speak with you. Okay, my brother discouraged me. Then behind my back he went to you. So what do you want me to do now? To leave your brother and follow you? Answer me. You said you first saw me and fell in love yes. with me. And your brother discouraged you. You allowed him to. That means you never loved me. No, 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 no. Don't say that. Look, I came back. I came back to see you. But on that day, your shop was not open. I, I didn't see you. I couldn't find you. I'm sorry. Maybe it's the will of God for us not to be together. Your brother has already engaged me. I mean, I, I cannot leave him at this point. It's not right. Please, let's understand it. Can I go now? No, the most important thing is peace. Let us have peace so that we can make eternity. I don't like it. You are welcome. You are welcome. This envelope contains our birth certificates. I want you to examine them. Find out who was born first. Who 
Ogoge Chukudiki. Born 20th February 1983. By 11.45 pm at Live Valley Hospital. Ekene Dilichuku Dike, born 20th February 1983. By 11.59 p.m. <laughs> this is conspiracy. This is rubbish! Rubbish! Now, every one of you should leave this silence right now! Okay, what? Dear, you won't believe this. I mean, do you not have to stick yourself after talking to you? I can't continue this work. I can't. This, this guy might kill someone something. Stop talking like a coward. What do you mean? She's not fighting us. He's not fighting us. Eh? But I wish we didn't run away. Reverse could have been the case now. Me, I better run for my life. Oh. Yes. Do you know? I was so scared when he broke that knife, collected the knife from me. I thought you were trying to beat me before he snatched it away from me. That guy is a trained criminal. A criminal indeed. Really? You know Shazra. Shh. 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 Call the police to arrest me. Officers, take him away. Handle him until he comes back to his normal senses. Take him off. Queen Mother, because the end, it hasn't gotten to this level, please. If you don't shut up, I'll ask them to take you along. Mother, why are you begging her? Am I scared of the police station? Listen to me, you shouldn't be bothered about I'm telling you because Officers. once I come back from that station <laughs> mother you know my character I will set this place Queen Mother I will set that place Officers take this place I will away. set this place Trust me I will set place. Did you like to see that place I will set Queen Mother, do you still remember what I told you when you asked me to marry your husband, the king? 
In case you have forgotten, let me help refresh your memory a bit. I refused. But you insisted. I agreed just to make you happy. I agreed to marry the king not because I loved him. Just because you asked so that I will help heal a bleeding heart. How could I hurt a soul that was there for me when no one was there? Queen Mother, you cared for me. You loved me. I called you blood sister because you're a friend that's not closer than a sister. This remember that day you ran into my daughter. They went to buy drugs for me because I was sick. He followed her to the house. To know how your friend was doing. You came, you gave me money. How could you turn around now to punish me? Because of our sons. But I loved you. I love you. I will always love you. Akeli, I am still surprised about what happened. If that boy had injured me with that knife, what would have been the result now? It's either you are dead or you are in the hospital by now. Look, something needs to be done urgently to put a stop to this nonsense. Something like what? When you know it is that woman who of your mother that is responsible for all this. Are you serious? Yes. She doesn't want her son to lose the throne. Hey. <laughs> Uh, oh, oh no, it was said you were with the late king in the hospital when the two boys were born. Oh yes, I was with him. But I wasn't there when the certificates were issued. This is serious. Oh no. Oh no. Hi. Uh, oh no. Now, it is only the king and the doctor that can testify uh, the truth. It could have been better if the doctor had not died too. What does she want in my house? Let her come and tell us what she wants. Let her come. I ask for that I came to my greet you all. Obiyama, what do you want in my house? Now, I came to report something to you. Go ahead, I'm all ears. First, I want to apologize for what my son did. Please, I am deeply sorry. Please Is forgive that... him. Is that what you came to report to me? No, nine. Actually, a few minutes after you left, Kuni Loma brought in the police and arrested my son. Oh, that serves him right. That serves him right. Uloma was right. At least that will calm his brain in the station. Yes. So Ekene is in the police station now. Yes, and I. Please. Get up. No, please, I'm sorry. Please help me. Follow me to the police so that we can talk to my the police and release my son. Get up. Get up. Sit down. Thank 
I will go. Not because of you. But like it. Eh? Oh no. You want to go with her? Yes, I will go with her. Even though what the boy did was wrong. But still, it doesn't deserve police humiliation. I will get back. You can't try it. Henceforth, there will be no cabinet meeting in this palace again. So leave this premises right now. Osegini. Hey, Ekene, do you realize you are talking to the owner who are for Laga Kingdom? I don't care. Look, I consider this an affront. Open this door so that we hold our normal meeting, Ekene. Hey, oh no, I'm sorry. But I will not. Oh no. With all due respect, I am leaving. But let me make something clear here to everyone now. The moment I leave this place, I will never set my feet here again. Uh, oh, oh, Mona. I will go with you. Go with you. Let's sort this thing out. Ah! It's your Mona. Dalu. Thank you very much. I support that your wonderful and brilliant idea. Leave this palace and never come back. Is it because Ogeti is not around? Of course, the name of a human being, not the name of a dog. Hey! Come on, open this door. Let us have a meeting. Hey, Kine. Okay. <laughs> it's like he's open opening. Door. It's like he's opening the door. He's coming to open it. Yeah. Who is he? Why would he open the door? For what? Who are you? He's opening it. Huh? Hey. 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 Now, all of you should kneel down! I said kneel down! I can not kneel down! I can't 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 now listen to me. Now open your eyes and fuck it. Never come back. Now! I will become the king of your life. Nobody! Nobody can stop me. I will be king. I will be king. How are you, my sweetheart? Welcome. Thank you very much.
Mother, yes, dear. this is the woman I want to marry. She is the reason you don't see me recently at home. <laughs> Thank you very much. How are you? My queen, you are welcome. Thank you. And how are you? I'm very fine. Please, let's go inside. I call this meeting because uh, I have something very important I want to discuss with you. Thank you very much for honoring this uh, meeting. I, you know, I want to inform you people that I, I want to do my traditional marriage. Is this why you sent a girl to wake me up? Yes. Is it not enough reason to wake you up? Without their support, my marriage was good. Bam. Julius. My prince. You're the one who came to wake me up, right? Yes, my prince. Jeez. Next time that mad dog sends you to do something like that, Telling you will not. Yes, my prince. Get out. What happened? Not you know. Just that I went to him to deliver the message you sent to me.
Julius. Julius. Where is Julius? I don't know, my prince. You don't know? If I had a run, I can't get a phone. If I had a run, I can't get a phone. I said, Where is Julius? I don't know, my prince. You don't know? Okay, call me, come to your house. Uh, None of them are here. What happened? Grandmother chased them away. What did you just say? Are you aware that your son employed some um, new meds and caps? Yes, Grandmother, I'm aware. And I asked him to discharge them. I've done that already. Okay. But the next time I will see strange faces in this palace, your son will not like my reaction. No, no. I learned that you sent away my guards and maids. That was just a little example of it. The next time I walk out and see strange faces in this palace, I will lock them up and make sure they rot in jail. I will regret ever being born in this palace. And I will make you understand that I, Lola Omalicha I of Olaga Kingdom, married the woman that gave birth to you. Watch me! Watch me! As far as I am concerned, those people will not come into this compound again. Okay. Oh, you want to bet? Let's bet! Let me sit down. Nick will be with Michiano. Sit down there, my friend. Hey, can you sit down? Shut up your mouth! Sit down, my friend. I'm talking. Right, there, I can bet with you. They're not right. Hey, can I? I said sit down! Shut up! Nick will be with you. Sit down there. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, this is my judgment. No, no. Oh, no. Allow those guys to resume their duty. Hmm? Are you okay? Huh? Tell those people to stay away from this palace. Mm -hmm. I have spoken. Mom, I will set this palace ablaze. Trust me. My friend, okay, and then we can't. When an elder is speaking, you listen. Nikita Refonu Ginsi, dear. Idiot. If I'm talking, you shut up. Hello. Uh, there is something on my mind I, I wish to execute. So I want to share it with you first. And what could that be? I want to take this matter to court. Yes. I've already gone to my lawyer. I told him to prepare a suit. As it stands, believe me, No, from what I'm saying, only the court can settle this matter. You said you've gone to your lawyer. And he has prepared a suit for you. You took a wise decision. You see, your brother again, he is very, very stubborn. But this time, he has no choice. Hmm. You know. Thank you for your understanding. As usual, 
<laughs> My prince, let me pray for you. As you go to court with your brother in Kene, victory is your middle name. Amen. Nothing will stand between you and victory. Amen. In fact, when you go, tell your lawyer to slam him the order of Mandamus so that he will have no escape route. <laughs> it shall be well with you. Thank you. Who does not know you is a novice in Ulaga? A visitor. <laughs> Whoever that doesn't know you came here on holidays. Hey, play, play. <laughs> Uno, aside my father, you are the next person in this kingdom. Uh, do I put a card? Uno, <laughs> if you say yes, no one can say no. And when you say no, no one can say yes. Yes. Don't do a card. <laughs> Uno, <laughs> if you say yes for me to be crowned the king of Ulaga Kingdom, I will bring down this bungalow and plant a duplex here for you. With extra five million naira stuck in your account. <laughs> Think about it. Five million naira. Five million naira. Five million. <laughs> this money you people have been giving me. A Kenny's own is bigger than your own. We're doing enough for your band, it's just a jay band. I'll walk. Nonsense. Thank you. You are welcome. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh no, she is Amarachi. The girl I told you I want to marry. Good evening, sir. Oh, <laughs> my daughter, how are you? <laughs> so, what do I offer you? Oh, uh, no. Yeah. You don't have to worry. As a matter of fact, we brought something for you. Oh, no. This is for you. This is very special old pot. Konya. <laughs> hey. uh, the prince of Olaga Kingdom. <laughs> ah, don't worry. Whatever shall be, shall be. Odera, Odego. Thank you very much. <laughs>
mother. Here he is. Ever since we got back, he has been like this. My son. What is it? Oh, give me. Mother. Yes? The music has changed. How? Oh. We were in Akiri's place earlier today. Mm -hmm. Akiri told me that Ogechi has filed a suit against me in court. It's a lie. This is not true. No, no, I don't believe it. I don't hmm. believe it. Mother, you better believe it. What? He is telling the truth. I don't just know why Ogechi is doing this. I can't explain. No. Oh. Mother, what do we do now? <sighs> Ekena, I am short of words. I don't know why Queen Mother should allow him to go to that extent. She might yeah. be behind this. Mother, I suggest that you go and meet her. You're a woman like her. Talk to her. Let's all live in peace. Eh, we fe je se mo ko eme o. Eh, that's nothing to us, please. I'm an anfo ija. Mom. I think the best thing I have to do now is for me to go and see my lawyer. I really need to go and see my lawyer. Do you have the birth certificate? No, I don't. <laughs> Lawyer, even if he has, it does not make any difference because they have altered the date of their beds. The onus of proof lies with the petitioner. Don't worry. Relax. I will prove beyond reasonable doubt in the courts that your own birth certificate is the original. I have done it before. And you will do it again. Barrister, let me tell you. I don't blab. I do as I say. If you win this case for me, I will buy you a brand new car. <laughs> That's wonderful. Oh, you bought a mug or one of a Laga Kingdom. <laughs> you can now go home and relax. Victory is sure. Thank you very much, Barrister. the queen of Laga Kingdom. Yes, he's my son. What happened to him? An accident? What? My own. Hey, Let's go, Mecca.
Did you see him today? Yes, I went there earlier this morning. And how is he? According to the doctor, he is getting better. Yes, I know. Nothing will happen to him. I pray so. Because if anything happens to him, all fingers will be pointing at me. The shock of the incidents affected his brain. Right now, he's mentally imbalanced. Take me. Hi. Okay, CJ. Hi. Uh, doctor, what's the next thing? For now, he has to be transferred to the asylum. Asylum? Asylum. But I can promise you, in a short while, he's going to be okay. You don't have to be bothered. Just relax, he's going to be okay. We must unite. We must unite. Okay. I thought the doctor said he was getting better. Mommy, I don't know. What is all this temptation again now? To him, since he doesn't know what he's doing. Do you know the implication of someone who is not a king to sit not on that to throne? To My dear, please let's just forget about that. The ways of the gods are not the ways of men. Mm -hmm. Let's just let's say him. nothing happens to him. Though. Nothing will happen to him. Nothing will happen to him. People to the fear. <laughs> I 
one of Laga Kingdom. You're welcome to my humble abode. Thank you. I heard what happened. I would have come but because of my own illness I couldn't make it. I know. Your daughter said so. So how is your health now? I thank God for today. I thank God. I'm really sorry about what happened. But don't worry. God must surely prove himself. Amen. You're welcome. Let me pretend I didn't hear that. And send a note of warning to you. Next time you open that your stupid mouth to say that to me, I swear by the gods of this land, you will ever regret ever having me as your mother. Your parents down there in the chain, all you could think about is traditional marriage. What is wrong with you? What do people say about you again? Eh? Have you lost it? But I don't care. I don't care. So because my brother is in shame, I should also be in shame? No, please. That's not what mother is saying. You have to calm down and listen to her. Please. What is she talking about? What is she talking about? Now listen to me. If you're not going with me, I will go and do my traditional marriage with outsiders. What rubbish is that? Did you just have to open okay. his lousy mouth to okay. say that? You heard him. Say. Calm down, please. He's not going to do that, definitely. I'm the one he's going to get married to. Please, calm down. Okay, let's let's see how it goes. Huh. This is what I want you to do. You have to untie him. It's not a big deal. You get me? I hope you have the keys. Yes, my prince. Good. But... There is no but. You don't have to give any excuses of any sort. You get me? Now listen to me. When you untie him, ask him to leave the palace and never come back. Okay? This is for you. For yourself. I will be leaving this palace very soon. In the next 30 minutes, strike the deal. Leave no traces. For you, your own. No matter what's going on, you are still a part of me. This is more than I can explain Is there something I can apologize for? We used to be brothers beyond every bothers How come right now we don't even talk? Uh -huh. 
we ain't even talk. Elders, I greet you all. Now, yes, sir. I called this meeting because I wanted it confidential. Since my brother took ill, this kingdom has remained stagnant. No one seems to be talking about the kingdom's future. I could remember before my brother got sick, I initiated my marriage. So, I want to use this opportunity to tell you officially that I want to do my traditional marriage. Oh no, I just said something. Oh, we heard you right. The reason I did not want to say anything is if you do what you've just told us you want to do, people will think you don't have conscience. Ekene, Unuwu is perfectly correct. Just, just, just excise patience. No, no patience. Patience. Ekene, Unuwu has said it all. Hmm? No matter the speed at which you travel, you will not go beyond your destination. Mm -hmm. Give your brother more time. More time till when? He's not getting better. Can't you see his situation is getting worse? Ekene, I will advise you to join hands with him and pray for him to get better. I can see that no one is feeling what I'm feeling. Ekene, we do. We know how you feel. The same feelings of your brother is what we are trying to protect here. Mm -hmm. Is there any other thing? Come on, that thing. Mm -hmm. What is the problem? The queen mother asked us to kneel down. Why? Ogechi escaped. What? What is your work in this palace? Huh? I'm asking, I'm asking you what is your work in this palace? Let me warn all of you. No matter the problem that is going on between me and my brother, he is still my brother. If I don't find him, I will throw all of you into the lagoon. Nonsense! Stupid people! Mad people! No, I didn't see him. I've searched everywhere. What of Amara? I thought you were together. Wait. Together? Yes. Oh, I've checked everywhere. 
how cold Kibo Kitchen is. Jesus. But he is far away from this kingdom. Without prayers, you may not set your eyes on him again. Pastor, I will see my son alive in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. But we are going to embark on a very serious prayer and fasting. I will last for one month. And after that, I will come to your house for family deliverance. It's very important. Thank you very much, Pastor, for everything you've done for us. We appreciate. To God be the glory. Pastor, thank you very much. trying to prove to me that you make a good one. <laughs> Don't be funny. Now promise me that you would join them in the prayers. I promise. Alright, that's very good. I'll be traveling today. But I will call Mama often to find out if you truly join them or not. Because I know you very well. I have told you that I give you my word. I will join them. It's alright. But I'll find out. <laughs> I know you so much. You are very not good. You are very funny. We go in. I am here to deliver a message to you. The council has decided to crown a Kennedy king of Umaga. I mean, the, the kingdom cannot continue without a king. And it is nobody's fault. Sit. 
Kopyama, why are you like this? I trusted you. You appear as a saint to me. And you backstabbed me. Why? Why, Obioma? Queen Mother, gods of this land will bear me witness that I've never backstabbed you since I came into this palace. Obioma, I trusted you. I trusted you. Queen Mother, what are you talking about? Could you please tell me what is it so that I can defend myself? Oh no, who brought your message to me? What? In the past one week, I've not set my eyes on Ono, let alone discussing with him. What is it that he say I said? He revealed to me about the plan you made with him. To crown Ekene as soon as he gets married. What? And you are here deceiving me with your fake prayers. Why, Obioma? Queen Mother, like I said earlier, I have not set my eyes on Ono. I didn't discuss my son's crowning or his marriage with Ono. Queen Mother, there's something you need to know about Ono. He has been making advances at me. Before I came into this palace, he asked for my hand in marriage, but I turned him down and followed the king on your request. And that is why he has not been free with me. And no one notices it. But that is why he's punishing me by saying things I did not say. After our husband's death, he invited me to his house. Where is dead. What? And tradition has now set you free. Just do it with me. I swear I will never ask you for it again. Excuse me. What will you never ask again? Just... I promise you I will restore peace in the palace. Please. Oh, please stay away from me. Does not mean you will not do it if I don't sleep with you. I can't. Obiama. You mean you've been going through all this in the hands of Akede? Yes, Queen Mother. But I didn't want anybody to know because I didn't want to bring trouble into the palace. So whatever he said, I said, were not true. I didn't say anything to Akede. Shut up. Oh. 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 
stress. I'm not going to get you mad. I'm not going to get you mad. I can take your time. In fact, I can't stand here and, and take this nonsense from all of you. My brother, the king, and 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 he told me, hey, I swore that I would never allow you have peace in this kingdom. Please forgive me, oh, because you know, because. Mention anything you want me to do to him. I want him to die in accident. <laughs> To be suspicious. Don't you know that people will suspect you if it happens like that? Then make him mad. Eh, eh. Yes, after the accident, then madness. If you combine the two, nobody will find the traces. Yes, uh, <laughs> accident yeah. plus madness. Is that all you want? <laughs> That's all. But she said her love belongs to her late husband. Is the king her late husband? Oh, because I don't have money. Or maybe I'm not the king. But she kept collecting things from me. Obiyomwe. Obiyomwe. I will make life unbearable for you in that palace. Whoever it affects, it's not my business. All I care is my money, my yam, my fish, my time. Obiomo, you never go scot free.
beg you stay with me. Mother, I understand. But I can't stay here anymore. Your son deceived me. He lied to me. I feel terribly bad because you have always treated me like your own daughter. And that is what you are. And I love you, but all the same, mother, I have to go. I really have to. I'm sorry. 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 Feed on you. So you're tired? Huh? 
Tourne les genoux. Like a kid of his sleeping. Where is my best certificate? I said, Where is my best certificate? I'll back up. Appreciation. Appreciation. Everything. Yeah. 